everybody, welcome to our first ever tutorial. Today we're going to be showing you how to create a Minecraft server and then uh, port forwards to, uh, so all your friends can join you. So I'm joined by Lord Apex, aka Cody. Yep, his only friend, the only one who gives a single shit about him. Yeah, and you're, well, your main reason is that you're here is because you're a dumbass. You can't set up a Minecraft server properly. So no, I'm here to teach you. This is a personal favor to you. Well, I'm ready to learn, all sensei. <laughs> okay. Right. The first thing you need to do is you need to go to Minecraft.net. Oh, first of all, sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First of all, you need to go and download yourself Notepad Plus Plus. Ah. What? You this because you're going to need. Why that. don't you explain the Notepad Notepad Plus Plus to people who? care I don't know it's notepad with extra features well like what what does it do i don't care man i don't care oh fucking noob okay uh you're gonna want to go to minecraft.net uh to download the minecraft server file so you're gonna go download uh you want to download this file here minecraft server exe mm -hmm. and when you have that downloaded which i have here Okay, you want to be going here. You're going to want to create a folder for this. So we'll Can I it. name it something like Big Boobies? Okay, Big Boobies. Big Boobies. Nice. Okay, get your Big Boobies folder. You're going to drag the server file into there. And you want to open your Big Boobies. <laughs> oh, I love opening my Big Boobies. Yeah. Okay, once you have a, like, a good look in your big boobies, your Minecraft server should be in there. Uh, so oh, you want to go and open that and run it. Hit run. Those guys on your desktop really like big boobies. Oh, they do. Of course they do. Wow. And when you wait for this to run, you get a better computer. Oh. Look at you. You're so technical. Mm hmm. Right, all this is going to run, it's going to start creating a world. Oh shit! You're gonna get you're gonna get a oh, few failures shit. there at the start. Don't worry about that. Now you should worry about that. That means you need to quickly turn off your computer <laughs> and Control, throw it in the trash. Four for boobies. <laughs> yeah, because it's downloading. After that says done, you're gonna want to hit stop. Type stop into there. Let it all stay. All that. Larky. <clears throat> God, my my computer's struggling now, man. I know. Look at this shit, man. What are you What are you running on? Like five hundred and twelve megabyte memory? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, right. You want to go and this is just this is what you need. No pad plus plus four now. Okay. Right. You ready for this? You so you're gonna right click on your server dot properties file. And you're gonna go edit with Notepad. So that's gonna open up now. You're going to need your server IP, your local server IP for this. So to get your oh, local, yeah. to get your local <laughs> server IP, you're going to want to go to it here. You want to open up the command prompt. So just type in cmd. Oh man, look at this! Look at that. It's fucking crazy. It seems you didn't know about a computer, did you? I know. <laughs> I know. This is this is what my, one of my problems was last night that I was putting the wrong IP. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't putting my internal IP address. I was putting my external IP address in here. Whoa! You're such a dumb dumb. I know. Okay, in the command prompt here, you're going to want to type in IP config like I've done here. I'm going to press enter. Smash now, the address, you have a lot of addresses here. The address you need is the IP4 address here. So I've got on the wireless because I'm on the wireless thing. Oh, um, so, shit. IP4 Hacking address. Computer. <laughs> yeah, you could. <laughs> I will. <laughs> you're gonna want this address here, which is the IP4 address. So you want to get that. It's obviously not gonna be that. It'd be different for you, depending. So you want to get that. You want to type it in there. So for me, it'd be 192.16. Ah, uh, what? Yeah, okay, see. What a stupid IP. Okay, you're gonna want to make sure online mode here is set to true. Reason for this is. If you have it set to false, people with uh, false Minecraft accounts, cracked Minecraft accounts can join your server. Don't want that. Don't want bad people joining. 
No, we don't. We don't want the common riffraff to join our servers. I want to hit save. Don't save it. <laughs> you want to close that? Okay. Now you're gonna to want to. You want to be up. This just. You want to be an op in your um, server so you can run all the commands, all the administrator commands. So you want to open the ops. Can I be an op? You want to I open want to the op. ops text file. You want to type your username for your your, your Minecraft username in here. Uh, okay, so look, you can be put your name in here, Lord Apex. Yeah, that's me, everybody. I'm an op. You're an op of this now. I better make myself an opposite because I need to do this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, PGZ Duff Man. Oh, everyone's going to try to, like, find our server. No, no, they won't. Yeah, they will. Everyone. Okay, so by default, when you run your Minecraft server, it will run with 100 megabytes of RAM. Uh which is fine for very small servers, maybe one or two, but when you have more people in there, it's going to take up more memory, so you're going to need more RAM running off it. So a little trick to do is you're going to want to right-click, do. Oh, uh, this I did document. not know. Just call it anything you want. I'll just call it run. Oh, I was going to say big boobies. Right, you're going to need this code here, the Java code. This basically uh, assigns the Minecraft server to run with a, a gig, 1000 megabytes. So you're going to allocate that much to your server. Oh shit, this is getting too technical for me, man. I'm out of this fucking thing. Get out of here. So you're going to put that in there. You want to save as. Okay, and then you want to go, instead of text, you want to change it to all files. All files. And you want to Every call it run dot bat dot batch. Dot bat. Dot bat. It's a batch bat. file, so. I'm going to save that. Like Batman? Not like Batman, no. No, like Batman. You can delete it's this Batman old one here, file. this text one, I don't know why I made that. I wasn't thinking. Okay, this is your name uh, as well. So from there on, you don't need to click on this. If you click on your run, it will run the server. So what? See, I didn't even do any of this shit. I I didn't do any of this. Hmm. All I did was it. What are you doing? What happened? You're running Everything's the batch okay. file, so, which calls the Minecraft server, which will run your server from there with the gigabyte of gigabyte of RAM. See, now I have. But I have a gigabyte of RAM now. It's only 63 megabytes, which is 95%. Look at that, man. Jesus. Man, you look, motherfucker. My computer would not like that. Huh? <laughs> okay, now, the next part is you have your server running. But. Do we? Nobody's able to connect to you from on the internet because your, your uh, ports are not forwarded. Oh, so but I don't... How do you forward my ports? I'm glad you asked that question, okay? Oh. So you want to go to this website here. You want to go to portforward.com. Oh. Uh, you would have guessed. Luckily, I have all my shit saved on my computer, so I didn't have to do this. Okay, now this is a great website. This website, you enter your brand and your model of your router, and it will give you a step-by-step -step guide of how to... Uh, uh, forward your ports on that router because every router is different. Yeah. So for me, I go, I have a Cisco. He has, let's see, a Linksys, I bet. Oh, yes, I do. Where the hell is it? Uh, everyone has a Linksys. I don't even know if I don't know any other brand. I have a Linksys, where is it? It's a Linksys EPC2 thing. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, is it, a, is it a good router? That's decent. It came with my internet provider. Okay, now you're going to get a list of games here or applications to things. So you want to come, come down here and you go to M, uh, Minecraft server. See, no. It's all done for you here, man. Now, this, I can't really help you much more than this. This will give you a step-by-step -step guide. You need to follow all, all through that. It will help you all out. 
because uh, you you need to be very very careful because if you enter, you just got to make sure you put it one hundred percent correct. Yeah, you'll fuck everything up. Oh yes, you will. Okay, uh, I have there's an other there's an alternate version of doing this. Uh, there's the, there's this uh, application called Simple Port Forwarding, which actually if you download it and you put in your router and your model, it'll do it all uh, automatically for you. Oh, it just does it? Just does it? Fancy. I we might do a tutorial at that uh, a future date maybe of that application, but uh, anyhow, that's it. So you got to do that, and after you're done, you sh your uh, port should be forwarded. If you want to check, you should type in port checker. Oh, see, I didn't know this shit. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it's handy because I didn't know you could check it. No, yeah, you, if you, you want to check if their ports are forwarded. So you want to. Port checker. You just want to go 25565, which is, the def, which is what Minecraft uses for the ports. Oh, shit. This will check if your ports are open. Mine's closed. Uh, his ports are always open, if you know what I mean. So your ports are opened. You got a server, man. So what? What? What next? Is there anything else? Yeah. After you have your port forwarded, like I've just done now, you are going to need to get your external IP address. Uh, oh. to say, uh, you're going to use this IP address. You're going to send it to your friends. They'll use it to join the server. That's as the address. He doesn't so, have friends. Okay, you'll send it to yourself. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I well, basically alone. I just use for to get your external IP addresses. I use I just use this website portfolio.com. At the top right corner, it'll tell you it. So you, on the top right corner there, it'll tell you your, your external IP address. So you want to take that down, copy copy it down. Oh. Send it to your friends mm. and all that whoever wants to join. So they'll come in here. Can, what? Can your grandma play? Would she be able to play? Um, well, she can't turn on the computer. Oh. This might be an issue. Well, you can do a tutorial video for her for that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, now, that's... do you want to enter in the server address, the external IP address? Bam. Please work, please work, please work. Dun, 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 Didn't work. Dun, dun. Oh, it worked. Oh. <gasps> Victory ah, won. yes. A working server, finally. Some tutorial this has been. Oh, it's, it's I awful. didn't learn shit. Wait, do you want me to do it all over again? I'll start over. Uh, No, I don't want to watch this. No, I don't want to watch this shit again. It's beautiful. Yeah. Look at this. It's beautiful. No. Okay. See, so look at that. You say, I don't know how to do a server, but you know, but you know what? On your server list, it says Cody server. I, I can do it. Mm -hmm. Look at this. The beautiful world you're in. Now I'm going to show you how to play Minecraft. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not show Let's you. see your skin. Show everybody your skin. Oh, yeah. What Look at me. You? My Manchester United Robin Van Persie. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What a douche. Yeah, he's just jealous. Okay, that's basically it. Guys, for uh, servers and port forwarding, uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe if possible. Yes, please do. Tell us uh, what you think and if it was helpful. And if it was, we'll do more. So we'll see you later next. See you next time, guys, for next tutorial. Bye bye.